Red light runners who got ticketed because red light cameras know how expensive that can be. Well, red light camera tickets are about to end in Doral with the city poised to lose hundreds of thousands of dollars because of the change. Why the change? CBS News Miami's Yvonne Taylor is in Doral to explain. Yvonne? And I'll tell you what, guys, average price of a citation for running a red light in Doral, $160. Right now, we're on Northwest 87th Avenue and 36th Street. This is one of four intersections that, according to city officials, the busiest, and at the same time, the ones with the most accidents. Reduce speed, educate drivers, and punish the ones who run red lights. That was the motivation for installing these cameras. This program, which is called the Red Light cameras uh, starting June 20th is going to come to an end. Doral Vice Mayor Rafael Pinedo tells CBS News Miami the decision stemmed from comparing intersections like this one on 87th Avenue and 25th Street, which has no cameras, to ones that did, like this one on Northwest 79th Avenue and 41st Street. It's one of four intersections listed on the city's website as the busiest. We have more car accidents in these four intersections than any other intersection in the city. A lot of the drivers, when before they passed, they were passing by these intersections, they were scared every time that you had the, the, the yellow light before the red light, and they used to actually stop the car suddenly. Last month, Vice Mayor Pinedo sent this memo to the city council saying, many studies have shown that red light cameras increase the number of rear end collisions. The majority of the council approved the repealing of the program, for some drivers, this is music to their ears. I think that's a great idea. I think we should keep that up. And sometimes it's very unfair that you get a ticket here, you get another ticket over there. By the end of the day, you spend all your salary in tickets. Jonathan Torres, who lives in Doral, disagrees. Because many people disregard traffic lights. I like the cameras issuing tickets, he said. And let's not forget the economics. So how much money was the city getting from these traffic violations? Last year, we received over $600,000. Well, keep in mind that if you get a citation between now and midnight, you will have to pay that ticket. The change will start tomorrow. Now, cameras will continue in this city, but for different purposes. Live in Doral, Ivan Taylor, CBS News, Miami.